morning students i hope you all are doing good it's me sir rehan yusuf and today you are having lecture number 5 of physics in this lecture we are going to start our chapter number 3 that is kinematics of linear motion so let's begin let's begin with our definition of the rest and motion in physics the objects which do not change their position are said to be at rest means if an object is not changing its position with respect to its surrounding so an object is said to be in the state of rest whereas if you are talking about motion so the objects which change their position with respect to its surrounding they are said to be in the state of motion rest and motion are the relative terms Sometimes it happens that the body is at rest with respect to some other body but at the same time it is in the state of motion with respect to another body For example if a person is sitting in a compartment of a moving train will find it all the things around him in the compartment are stationary but for a person standing in the platform all the things in the compartment are in the state of motion You can understand this by a more example that if a passenger is sitting in a moving bus, is at rest because he is not changing his position with respect to the other passengers or the objects in the bus, but to an observer outside the bus, the passenger and the objects inside the bus are in motion. So, from these observation, we can conclude that the state of motion and state of rest are simply related to one another. Let's come to the types of the motion. Different objects move differently. Some objects move in a straight line, some move in a curved path, and some move in other different way. So uh, there are three main types of the motion. The first one is transitory motion. Second one is rotatory motion, and the third one is vibratory motion. Again, with the transitory motion, we also call transitory motion as linear motion. In this type of motion, the body moves in a straight line or a curved path. Every particle in the body is being displaced by the same amount. The motion of a car on a flat road, the motion of the motorbike on a circular road, and the motion of the cricket ball. hit for a sixer are all example of the transitory motion so uh, there are three types of the transitory motion linear motion circular motion and random motion if the body is moving in a straight line it is said to be in linear motion if the body is moving in a circular path it is said to be in circular motion and if the body is having some irregular motion so that is said to be random motion it means that we can categorize them into three types few of the examples are given here as well that the linear motion example is the aeroplane flying in a straight line circular motion example is the motion of the earth around the sun and random motion example is the motion of the smoke or dust particles in the air Uh, let's come to the second type of motion that is the rotatory motion the spinning motion of a body about its axis is called the rotatory motion it means that if a body spins or rotates about a fixed point or axis its motion is called rotatory motion the rotation of the earth around about its axis the wheels of a moving car and the blades of a moving electric fan are the few examples of the rotational motion you can see that the motion of the every particle of the blades of a fan is a circular or rotatory motion now let's come to the third type of motion that is vibratory motion vibratory motion is a back and forth that is to and fro motion of an object its example is a swing set uh, it vibrates back and forth as you swing it the motion of the pendulum of a clock is also an example of the 
vibratory motion so in today's class we discussed about the rest we discussed about the motion we also discussed about the different types of the motion that is transitory or linear motion rotatory motion and vibratory motion so i hope that you all understand it very clearly with different types of examples for more information you can refer your book page page number 32 33 and 34 to more enhance your concepts so that's all for today all of you stay safe stay home thank you